come in, come in. Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. We are here in Daytona for a Jeep event. So, we are starting our trip here at our place where we are staying, so let me give you the tour, come along. So we have this huge laundry room. Waste of space. Crazy for a, for a you know, little place to stay, but hey. And it's got a steam iron, so that'll be handy if we need it. All right, let's bring it to the kitchen, which I think is really nice. Probably one of the nicer kitchens for just a little place to stay. I mean, this is a huge island, so you can do a lot of cooking, which we probably won't be doing yeah, because no cooking. we eat out a lot. Okay, so here's the living room area. I don't know if you can see it. We didn't turn on a lot of lights. Uh, the balcony, you know, my boyfriend's cheap. He doesn't get us the room with the ocean view, but you know, I shouldn't be upset. Beggars can't be choosers. If you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. You know what they say. Okay, come in here. Uh, we have someone staying with us, so this is gonna be their bathroom. And then here's their room over here, which looks really nice. Uh, the ceilings though, all these are the same ceilings all the way around. It's like an industrial vibe, I guess. I don't like it. I, I'm on I the mean, fence. it's different. I'm on the fence. Okay, come on. We're going to our room, and then that's, that will, you know, end our tour of our uh, accommodations for the next, I guess, four nights or something, five days, four nights. Okay, here's our room. I've already started kind of unpacking, but not very good. Okay, here's the bathroom. Okay, you can come in and see the shower if you want. The, the toilet's in its own room back here, and then we have these mirrors. Um, you can turn it on and off, which, and then there's another button, but I don't know what that does because I'm, I'm not very fancy, I guess, or at least not in that way. Anyhow, so this is where we're going to be staying. We're going to see some Jeeps in this video. We're going to have some good times, maybe, hopefully, we'll see. And uh, we're going to bring y'all with us. So keep tuning in and we will see you soon. Okay, it is Thursday. We are here at the- No, it's Friday. Oh, it's Friday? Yeah. Okay, excuse me. It's Friday. We are here at the event. There is a lot of good stuff. Wolfie and I walked around a little bit before we started filming just to get a, a vibe. And there's some really cool stuff here. Really, like tons of Jeeps, obviously. This is a Jeep event. So y'all are gonna see nothing but Jeeps today, which is fitting since uh, we do have a Jeep. So we're gonna take y'all around. We're gonna try to find some really cool Jeeps. Look at all the, uh, there's a lot of vendors here selling their products. And um, y'all can comment down below what your favorite Jeep is, what your favorite product is you saw. And we'll talk about it in the next video. So let's go look around. Okay, first Jeep of the day. Look at this audio system. Well, I don't really know much about audio, but we got some horns or something, right? Yeah. Or, and then maybe some subs. Maybe some speakers somewhere in there. But either way, it looks amazing. So let's go look around the front. Oh. <laughs> okay, uh, let's go. We can go this way. They got door. Yeah, the door panels are sick. That's crazy. You know. Wolfie has door panels in his uh, JK. Maybe y'all seen him, maybe you don't. Um, that, this doesn't stick out as far, right? I mean, it does stick a little bit, but Wolfie's just sticks right into your leg. And okay, then, here is our second Jeep. This is a very uh, famous Jeep, we were told today. So come, well, you can see the side. It's called El Jefe. Um, so it used to be a YJ, and he and the owner says that there's only two pieces left of it that's still considered YJ, and everything else is just completely re redone. I have the specs here. Let's go to the front of it then. For, for instance, um, which y'all might know what this means more than I do, but a double triangulated four link suspension, um, front hall frame. 15 inch stretch back call frame hood vent okay this is just a lot of lists i'm sorry oh hey sorry i was just relaxing in my oasis trail cover that puts to the back of my jeep and i can just sit out here in my chair and be shaded from the sun oh. Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> 
So we do got our front end sway bar disconnected so we get more articulation out of the front end. I tell what we're doing. We're on a we're on a off-road adventure. <laughs> This one is a hybrid plug-in. So okay. it uses a two-liter inline four-cylinder with a turbo oh. with an electric motor and battery. Oh, we get 374 horsepower, 470 pounds of torque, eight-speed automatic, so yeah, about a 30-degree tilt on our berm there. And we got a... <laughs> yeah, so we're already in four low. It's about a 20 or a 30-degree angle up. nice yeah. okay we're taking a intermission and I'm going to hold a gator I have never done this before so here we go all right you want to sit up the fence real quick are you nervous Three fingers under the armpit, thumb under the other armpit, again towards you. Gonna hold from underneath like I am now. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. That is not what I expected him to feel like. He's he's not like they look like they'd be like hard shelled kind As of. As they get older they will become more of that rougher, okay. denser texture, especially on the back. But right now, while they're so young, they are fairly Soft, I guess. Okay. Smooth. What do you think? That I just yeah. I guess he's a he's used to this. I guess uh, he doesn't love it. He, I mean, we just, as my friend in the booth said, we just got these skaters like a couple of weeks ago, so not oh, entirely sure. used to it yet. Gotcha. Oh, he breathes really big, and then like his stomach goes really small when he like breathes out. That is so weird. Okay, we are at Jeep number three. Here we are. Incredibly nice. I like the blue. What are you thinking about the blue? It's dope. I know, I do. Okay, so remember, remember, we're picking the best one. Or, or you're... Y'all are picking one. the best one. Y'all's good one. And Wolfie and I will pick our favorite one, too. Alright, we're making our move. Okay, we got the Apocalypse 6x6. This is yeah. uh, those are like 58. Sorry that so we're at, we just saw it here those by the are like seven inches. And Come look close. The vendors, the vendors are actually brown. If you look at them close enough, they're actually brown. They're not bronze. Um, and then the, the shocks, they have coils in them. So they, the suspension flexes. They splatter And that, that would be the axle, the thing that's oh, pointing at. Yeah, they yeah, if you look at it, there's actually an axle down there. Um, and then there's like some steering components. It's pretty cool. Number five or six, but I'm not sure. Okay, look at this on track and a snowboard in the back. That is so cool. Hey, I got a Coke float. I know Wolfie and I are only supposed to be drinking water, but this is delicious. So, 10 out of 10 on the Coke float. We saved the best for last, everybody. So, come look around at this one. We got the pink, we got the big old boggers, we got uh, the KG ones, we got the pink. We got all the little ducks. We got, oh, look at this. We got the snow wolf on the back. So there was a lot of stuff here that we did not get to see because we're just trying to combine some of the things Wolfie and I thought were the best to show y'all, which there, but there's so many things here that were amazing. So I want to say that my favorite thing is 
the El Jefe Jeep. I, that might have been the first or second one that we saw. I think that was really cool. What about yours? Obviously that. I mean, this one is pretty nice, isn't it? Yes. Okay, don't forget to comment below what y'all's favorite one is too. Okay, we gotta look at all of our ducks that we got. So let's see which ones we got. Okay. We got this little green and black one. Oh, a little sheep, cute. I'm not. Clown. Okay, these are these are cute. A little superhero duck. Unicorn. Red one. Oh my gosh, like a little. I don't know if he's a pilot or a sailor. That's cute. That's a sailor. Okay, a sailor. A little man with sunglasses on his head. Oh, he's surfing. That's cute. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Look at this. I love that. Okay, let's keep going. Another unicorn. Minecraft looking little one, but it's pink because it matches. That's so cute. I'm going to run out of places to hold on that's to okay. that. It's okay. Look at the little pink one. Oh, that's so cute. A little flamingo. Oh, I love all the pink ones. That's so cute. Well, I guess we were having so much fun, we decided to be the last people here in the parking lot. And then they locked the gate on us. So we're going to have to do some off-roading and go over the curb, I guess. Are you driving or me? Oh, gosh. Should I drive? No, I got it. Okay. <laughs> Why would they lock us out, though? I don't know. That doesn't even make sense. I mean, what are they going to do? And how did everybody clean out so quick? Like, I don't even know. I guess we were over there for a while with the gladiator making sure it got on the trailer. Okay, so maybe that's why. 